Jordan Cleveland has a fun story. I'm sure you're going to love what's your best Michael Hayes story. Oh God. So many with Michael. Yeah. Without telling a story, I guess the greatest thing I, you know, for a guy that admired Michael a lot was we were getting off the, uh, the tram at the land airport riding upstairs and, and I'm walking over to get in the car with Arn and, Michael's walking over to get in a limousine with Cher and Greg Allman. And I said, Michael, you've made it, brother. <laughs> Cher was standing right there. No shit. That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. And then I went with Michael to the limelight to see her back in the 80s. We drove in from uh, Columbus. He come, <laughs> God, I love Michael Hayes. He's, he had been such a good friend for so many years and so long. And had so, so many good times. My 40th birthday in Sabatino was at Baltimore. <laughs> a night to remember. <laughs> Mark Clark wants to know, did Rick ever meet Elvis Presley? And has he ever been to Graceland? Neither one. I kind of thought for sure you would have been to Graceland at some point. No, I never have been. Isn't that funny? You know, it's funny. I've never been in the Smithsonian Institute to see my robe either. <laughs> well, we should make that happen. I was there I was there as a kid, but I never never got to go there um um, I've been to the Smithsonian as a kid, but I've never been to Graceland. Carl wants to know when was the first time you met Hulk Hogan? In Atlanta TV, Terry Bollea, okay. Sterling Golden. How about that? He was on his way to Memphis. But what a, what a, what a, what a great physique he had then! Wow. <laughs> 